currently doing some classic fucking oh, I have a Sherman. I've just been shoving bodies into this trench. Really want this one kid. Better got shot in the head. I only have one med kit on this dude. That's like a non issue. <laughs> That's like <laughs> Okay. That's real <laughs> Okay. I'll take it. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I fucking love I fucking love this game. It's just chilling there, man. It's just having a good time. We have a signaler, so I could mortar it, but I mean it's it's literally it's just vibing there. So there's like a shit ton of barbed wire. So we started off behind that sandbag right there. We lost one of our first four, like in the first gunfight we got into, which was annoying. And then I just kind of fell back to, there was like a thingy here. So we held out here for a little bit. And then I had the tank smash all the trees in this area and posted up the trench here. Contact your put the front. tank behind the boys, because you can replace the boys pretty easily, but it's pretty hard to replace the tank. So like, if someone gets shot, what I'll do is I'll just fucking tie another dude and shove him in there. I've learned to be like less attached to my people. I don't really buy them new guns. Unless they still like, start with a shotgun. So we can actually contribute. Because he's been here since the start and he's gotten like oh, one kill from like now. people who've gotten close. So now he can actually contribute to the battle. Meaningfully. Like. I would like to get a camp met up and start getting a reserve of people, but like whenever someone dies, like you gotta you have to have someone take their place on the line. Fire on our left side, don't let him get around the back. Enemy neutralized. Cause there's only so much you can do to stop people from getting shot. Like they're gonna get shot and you're gonna have to fill all the gaps on the line. Yeah, the Sherman's pretty fucking, pretty good. It's just been blast in the f Like, it's got a pretty small blast radius, but, like, it stuns them, which, like, means they don't shoot, which means you can shoot them without worry. And I would like to get a cam net up over these boys and just get, like, a second trench, like, right here, which is kind of like a reserve that I put the wounded dudes into. And... Trying to get like a medic up and shit. Cause I'm just like, I'm not gonna fuck with bunkers, you know? But I probably should get a bunker just for fucking airbursts. Been really lucky, haven't been hit with any artillery or airbursts yet. The, uh, I got a scout which is helping with that cause we can see who's coming in, which means they get shot sooner. That machine gun's just sitting right there, just waiting, just waiting for its chance. Getting a sniper wouldn't hurt cause then, like, could actually take pot shots with these guys. So like, we kind of know what's coming our way. I love how the trench just gets so fucking dirty. That is cool. More rifle grenades honestly wouldn't hurt. would be terrible play. Some help. Immensely. I feel pretty good on health, except for the scout. He got the things pretty hard. I got an officer to keep him around. I think I'm gonna get another rifle grenade. Here, I would like to get a cam net, but like the investment I'm gonna need of like the fuck. If I get a Waffen SS wave and I survive it, that's when I'll start doing that. I'm just gonna focus on like surviving that shit if we get to it. 
We've got the highest combat and the highest health here. Signaler is going to be like calling in support and shit. So I would like the engineer to have it. I don't know what the uh, the effect of difference between like a Garand and a Springfield does, but yeah, he can't hurt. Next German armor of some variety, maybe. Hopefully the Sherman can kill it. I've noticed the Sherman doesn't really like to shoot at enemy vehicles, which is concerning, to say the least. The Sherman has taken five points of damage thus far. I'm nervous, man. They're going to hit us with something big. I just know it. It's been like three waves now. There's the vehicle right there. It's right in the Sherman's line of sight. Just a half track. Oh! I fucking love to see it. Oh, shit. Oh, shit, okay. I don't know what shot that guy did, okay? Go off. Yeah, go off, King. Alright. Dump dude, dump that. Maybe it was the scout. Oh yeah, that's not where I would have fired the weapon grenade. Holy shit. Come on, boys. Threat the grenades. I think the names would be very nice right now if you can start shooting off some of them like grenades. <laughs> some of them are going to be stupid and burn themselves. Oh, I just burned the one and got it away. Thank God the uh, Sherman's drawing the fire that thing. I'm, I'm going to need you boys to fire them right for grenades. Home, you know, I mean, I get into it. Get the three. There we go. Uh, none of them have Panzer Fouch, so I'm not too worried about them getting hit in the tank. I don't know why the hell that guy was starting to stealth, but. Yeah. Oh, there goes the city. Never even got to call anything here. God damn. Let's just get another one. Yeah, good thing I didn't give the right Scratch Promotion! Shit, who died? Pretty good. Officer got dinked. All in all, that was... That was, uh... That was two half-tracks. We held it off pretty nicely. He's just methodically emptying that magazine. <laughs> Fucking machine. Look at him go. Yeah, that tank is doing fucking work. I can't wait till. Well, I, well, I hope anyway that at some point it's like one or two where the, uh, the vehicles get actually doing shit too. Because right now they just like let's guarantee the XP hog because they have no XP to gain. No, Damn. No, don't be dead. No, get the scout. <sighs> I get a scout. That's a confirmed kill. Get an AT guy. Just in addition to the rest of grenades. 
So I don't want to have to buy another grand because I need to buy a, someone to replace this signaler too. Yeah, people just keep dying and then we just shove more bodies into the trench. <laughs> it's been working pretty good. More Jerry vehicles on the way. Oh, looks like they ran over that barbed wire. Good amount of moving in over here. We can do it, boys. We got the Sherman back in a sub. The reason I got the Sherman back is because I'm terrified of Panzerfaust and I don't want to lose it. And like, it can already, it can shoot farther than the infantry can anyway. So there's no real point to moving it up. It's just like, it's a force multiplier. It's not like a fucking... Like, if you send it up to soak fire, that's what it's going to do and it's going to fucking die. And it's like our main AT as well. And also, its explosions are very good for group suppression. Which is a vast improvement over Mud and Blood 2. Like, when I first saw the stunt thing, I was like, oh, it's kind of weird. But now I really like it, because it, uh, like, if a fucking 20 millimeter or whatever, like, if a fucking howitzer shell goes up next to your head, you're not just going to be like, oh, I guess I'm, I'm just going to fucking keep shooting. No, you're going to be like, oh, you're going to be kind of dazed. You're going to be like, whoa. Whoa, and you're gonna like, you're gonna just fucking, you know? So I like that. I like that very much. Although, I would like the paper dolls to like, like, I wanna see some German heads getting blown and shit. Like, I wanna see like this dude, I wanna like see the top of his head like sprayed out on the back of the trench, you know? Like, I wanna see some variation to it. I wanna see like arms and legs get blown off and shit. Cause like rifle rounds can do that, One especially these round. like thirty out six. I think that's where the grand fires at like this distance. I feel like if you hit them in the right spot, you could take off an arm. And if I feel like if it does enough damage, you should. That would be cool to like to see, like a little fucking like this arm just severed, like a little chunk flying. But like the body's still intact, just like pieces off but I want to see like snipers when they get headshots I want that to be modeled I want there to be like half of the dude's head pieces gone here come the Germans shit I've been really lucky because they've only been calling air they've called like three airstrikes on me if they call fucking anything else I'm pretty much fucked like Willie P fucking Somebody down? Officer's down, but he's not dead. Come on, boys. In this trench right now. Hey, if we survive, they're delivering this to us, though. See, like, they could have called that fucking. Yeah, they're just calling airstrikes. They could have called that fucking that shit out there. What the fuck? They're just not. I'm just getting way too lucky, man. This poor train got me right through the grenade. Yeah, that dude's probably gonna make it too. Rip the officer. Oh, dude. Like, I don't think that dude. Like, maybe it does damage to the tank. I don't know. Yeah. Maybe getting a gunner would be a pretty good idea. Oh, the one dude I was actually okay with crossing our line survived. Go get him. You don't kill this guy, I swear to God. I'm not gonna lie to you guys, I'm feeling a bit yeah, we'll uneasy about this. Yeah, we'll get a gunner in there. How's the morale? Oh, 
not good, actually. I feel like survival. Both with, with a gunner and a fucking. Oh, I didn't even need to use that. Shit. He starts with a bar, but... Just have that 24. Not great. Not great. He's at a 24% chance to hit. Hey, good shit, AT boy. Good shit. Got my dial up. Get you some kills. Do you see the joy when you can't work with these? Oh. See now this? This worries me. What? Do they really shoot two fucking Arty players at me, dude? I like you. I like you. Get the fuck out of there. Everybody else, spread out. No, get get in the trench, my man. Get in the trench, my man. Come on. You're fine. Get in that fucking trench. Hold that fucking. Get in. Oh, he's panicking. He's panicking right outside the trench. That's that's not what you want to do, man. You literally just put yourself in a worse position for no reason. I need to use this to like. This fucking still already going on. Can't shoot off the map, man. Yeah, put the fucking hold your ground. That's. That's a problem. Yeah, they want us fucking dead, man. They want us so dead. Come on, guns up! Right. I'm here. That's it. Have two losses right there. I'm sorry, the Germans are walking into their own fucking barrage. Oh, I need to use this to like even see where the trench is, man. This is so fucking full of bodies, but it's there. It's still there. Rip the gunner. Sorry, fucking TP. We just gotta shove more people in the trench. It'll be alright, I promise you. Oh, God. Just keep shoving bodies in the trench and we'll be alright. Trench is probably, probably smells so bad. The only survivor. He's probably gonna be the dude who gets the uh, accommodation thingy. Ready for more crowd? Taunt him, fuck it, what do we got to lose? What's the timer on that? Oh, that's fucking short as hell. You can fuck yourself with that, I imagine. I really need the TP. I need the TP so badly, man. We'll get an officer in there. That oh, we already did. We'll get a rifleman in there. Actually, I don't know if the riflemen are any better than the officer. Oh, I'm sad that got her back. Whatever. He was he had shitty combat. This officer has really good combat, actually. I'm just gonna get another officer, because I won't see a downside to it, and we'll just keep morale even higher. God, this trench is fucked. Tank's doing okay, though. Thing is, though, uh, the tank really needs infantry support. You can't, you can't run a world with just a tank. Beautiful. 
throw the goddamn body in that fucking trash. Rifleman reporting for duty and ready to kill some crap. We just gotta just build the trench, man. We'll be alright, no problem. We just gotta keep putting bodies in the trench. See, this is where the gunner would have come in handy. That's why the tank is good right there. Yeah, boys, you can do it. Springfield, Springfield squad all the way. Soon, just hold out. We just gotta put bodies in front of the tank so they don't target the tank. These guys are literally just meat shields. That's all they are. And I'm okay with that. I don't care about them. I don't care about Medill at all. Not one bit. Don't you even think that for a second. Yes, he dies. Did I give him rifle grenades? Yes. But like, at the end of the day, he dies. We got another Springfield waiting. Waiting to take your spot. A sniper. A sniper ain't shit. That's all she wrote for you, Sherman. Look at him go. He's gonna shoot. Yeah, he baby. I don't even know what he was aiming at. There's fucking organs and shit out of there. It takes me like a couple seconds of actually looking at the trench to see where the people are. It's hard to distinguish them from the bodies. I might, I might actually get a medic in here. Just to help these two out. Put some fire on that position. I'm gonna miss seeing those reactions More bodies we have in the trench, more fucking targets the Germans have to shoot at. Where did he go? There he is. That's, I think that's the highest combat a medic can roll, actually. So, where has he got a bright future ahead of him? Hopefully. Got him. We're gonna put him in between these two, so he heals them both, ideally. They're yeah, perfect well, they're actually gonna you know, match the little bit they got, so that he is the primary target. I don't know if that'll work, but it should. And we can we can afford one more dude, and we can fit one more dude, so... Look at that, that's like a perfect circle right there. That's kind of aesthetically pleasing. I like it. Imagine how crunchy it would be to walk on this thing. Oh god, that'd be gross. Do your job, medic, do your job. I'm gonna get an engineer in here so we can do the can now. That's such a fucking pipe dream. <laughs> yeah, man, don't worry. We'll, we'll get an engineer in there. We'll build a cam net. <laughs> I don't know if that's even going to happen. You can kind of see the circle in it. That's cool. God damn, this is fucked up.
Like, I love how in classic mode it's like all oh, the bodies over here. I didn't even know the bodies could despawn. Be honest with you. But. It's fucking. It's just clean. And then there's just like. Like the Germans that are advancing are like, oh, there's some, there's some chunky bits over here. And they get to like right here. They start seeing the bones and the lungs and shit. And then it's like, oh, God, oh, fuck. Yeah, we'll get an engineer in here. I just, I don't like that I have to buy him a gun. I like my GIs to come combat ready. I wish they came with the beast gun, because then he would have some suppressive ability. Like, I can get the scout come over with a shotgun, I can respect it. I just don't, I don't know why the engineer's gotta come with a shotgun. Give, give him my, give my engineer's beast gun back. Justice for the engineer. Someone's just been promoted in the field. I'm gonna actually get him my record here. After you get more records on the field. Get out! We're too bunched up! I love every now and then you just see an explosion that's just a tank doing its work. Tanks just a nice to have around. I don't know if that was a living German or a body or what, but it was, it was the best to look at. Something got killed. That's for sure. No. Let's see what you're doing once I can send it. Let's make that shell. You got shell. I repeat, man down! Okay. The Germans really just said fuck real, huh? Wow. Wow. Okay. Um. Fucking engineer. Play the tree game. Horses are a shot. Yep. A lot of Germans over there. Tank is probably going to blow itself up and get Panzer Cost to pretty soon. I guess he's just gone now. Fuck, okay. Cause the tank can't, like it can't kill people that are like touching it. It needs infantry support. So this is GG right here. Look at the trees, man. Oh wait, right there counts as our lines? Oh, I guess that's what it can be. That engineer that I bought was fucking dead. That's an idea. Or a stug. Either way, it's not a fun time. Now it's an idea. I'm 
feel like you people in this trench. U.S. Rifleman <laughs> on the field! <laughs> you want to get sent in. Just gotta shove them in the trench. You'll be alright. Just keep shoving them in there. Don't worry, you'll be alright. Medic will get you up. The Germans are fucking accurate, bro. They just pop the side of the trench like it's nothing. I want to get a map that has a hedgerow. So I can like Bodies in that fucking trench would be alright. I got it. Yo, he's dead. He's dead. He didn't even make it to the trench. Like, this is GG, but I'm gonna do what I can. That dude's probably gonna kill the tank. Can't even tell me to trash that. Run through it, I'm waiting for it now. I'm waiting for it. Let's do it already. Come on, what are you doing here? Blow the tank, I want you to. Just won't let the fucking tank open. Outstanding performance, Commander. You really showed him how it's done. Ordnance received 42. We had pretty good accuracy. Like last run, it was enemy accuracy. It was like 14 and ours was like 13. This time we actually had pretty decent accuracy. 219 enemies killed. Average soldier left. 17 minutes. Okay, then. We made one building. Wait, the trench didn't get destroyed, then. We deployed one vehicle. I don't know what that means, but okay. I don't know what max day means. But yeah, that's, that's pretty good.